Round two, Thursday night footy gets underway. The Bulldogs and Carlton at Marvel. And look at that, it's Cripp straight away to Walsh, to Fisher. Hands off, Hewitt. Now O'Brien will want to get back onto his left boot. Goes with the right, inside 50. First opportunity, Kerno gathers, snaps. Oh, what a start! Doesn't get any better for Carlton. Cripps at the back. Jumper being held slightly by Dale, who now takes a piece and spins him in the tackle. Durden. Fogarty, Kerno on the left. That's another. Lose look to work it down the field. Fogarty delivers it inside 50. Always has got to go. It'll spill to the front for Kerno. Onto his right boot. Bends it goalward. Blues need it. And Charlie delivers. He's kicked his third. Tough kick. For goal number five. Wow. <laughs> How good it was last week. Can he repeat the dose? Can he take it back to the MCG? Well, that's a mighty fine start. Then all of a sudden you get always charging through, you get space. It's a little clip across the top. Kerno, another two on the board. And everything is coming together for Carlton. Mitchell try to push it through, but it comes back by Chera and Silvani. Good service again. Mackay, the deepest forward, is on the move, doubling back Kerno. Oh. And again, replay of uh, the first quarter. Oh. Around he goes. It's another from the Carlton Guns. Charlie's got three. And he's going to quickly play on. He loves going around the body, does Charlie. What a start for the Blues. Silvani went for it. Alia second to it. Chera got it out somehow. Nunes around the body. It's touched so. It skips past a couple and it'll work for Kerno. He kicked one of the first 30 seconds last week. Does it again this week. He can be caught in no man's land. We saw it just then. Kerno plays on, hooks it around the body and delivers. On the siren. Oh, I'm with you on that. That Blues, Royal Blue family. You've got a Harry. You got Charlie, you got George now, George Hewitt in the midfield. How good are they looking? <laughs> Play on! Play on, sits it up. It sails a little, won't get there. Mark attempts. Charlie Kerno. Massive star on the rise. Came in flat. Aaliyah likes a bit of hang time on it and likes to come from behind. Heroic! Charlie Kerno, they're not home yet, but they can see the finish line from here. Justin Longmuir starts to have a problem. Charlie Kerno gives him another and gets the Blues second. Coming off five goals last week. He's 14 in his... Five goals coming into tonight. He stabbed at it, but made no mistake. Charlie Kerno kicks his second goal. It was pinpoint, and it had to be. There was three North Melbourne defenders. He's impatient. Kicks his first. And the two Carlton key forwards are threatening in this game, as we expected. It was a double-handed spike at best, that particular one, but uh, it was very effective. And around he goes. Is it in? It's in! Two for Charlie Kerno. Inside the forward 50. Carlton delayed. Eventually O'Brien found Newman. Meantime, bases are covered deep. Eh. The guy came with a rush. Kerno, quick thinking, evaluated. Right foot, goal. Three for Charlie. Three goals for last week for Charlie Kerno. 19-11 for the season. 
Crows kick the first two goals. Blues have kicked the last three. The first ton of many, we hope, for Charlie Kerner. It's working back. He's got it there. King Charles has done it again with some body English. 16 to 5 and inside 50s for this quarter alone. Kerno's got four. On Berry and Sart. Long. Drives it long. Goal square. Couple of options down there. Kerno waits. Sliced his way through them. Five for Charlie. He's got a handful. But they got one last one in them. Mackay. One poor. Can't rake it in. Charlie. He's got six. Had his defender in a blender. And kicked his six. Three metres and he's very pedantic about it. Kerno plays on, kick around the corner, he's missed. Has he? No, he's got it. Just snuck it in. Carlton by two goals. Need. This would make it a three-goal game. He plays on Kerno around the corner and he's got it. Carlton by three goals. Picked up by Durden, who's really worrying the Swans at the moment. Good ball to Kerno. Kerno will reel and go. No one deep in the goal square. Does he get a good setter? He does. Charlie Kerno, just magnificent. Dead. To narrow it to one point, and that's right through the middle. Shaping up as a beauty on Friday night. The Swans at the first change by a point. Listen, when this goes through. Three on the night already for Charlie. Playing from the side, the front or the back. To Ty Lynch at the top of the Coleman. He's got four. Thanks, Dan. Well. Keeps the handball off to the left footer here in Newman. Man coming him on the mark, so didn't get the penetration he'd hoped. Out the back, Kerno! Got another! He's got five! Five on the night. Great shot of it here. He's in blistering form. He's kicked 14 4 in the last three weeks. To respond for the Blues. Again, the Blues happy to hold it up. They've changed the tempo of this game. Cottrell will go to a two on one. Kerno gathers, snaps goalward. Brilliant! From 53 metres. That'll come back! That'll come back! That has come back! They're back to within 11! Steps one, steps two. Handball through traffic. Walsh can get it and go. Delivers inside 50. Two on one deep. Silvani! Over the top. Kano open goal. Final minute. Five point game. Charlie's got four. He's having a massive year. And that's going right through the middle. So, superb finish for the Blues to a really good quarter of footy. Great ball there for Saad from Cripps, end on end. And Laverde, it got past him. Mackay slaps it to Kerno, who dribbles the first of the second half. Kennedy. Has a lead in Kerno, finds him in the end. Had to be perfect and was. Kerno kicks the goal. Make it three in a row for the Blues. We're in front for the first time.
Jacobs comes a second time. Well, she started to dominate this game. Takes a bounce with confidence. Thought about a second. Went to Nunes. Steps one way. Didn't want the shot. Pierced it to Kerno. Plays on immediately. Hooks it around the body. Cue the crowd. <laughs> to Koning. Blue swarm around the footy. Here's Walsh again. Sending it deep forward. Silvani. Kerno. Bang! Massive goal. Charlie loves it. <laughs> it went directly to the boundary line. Blues through the corridor. Saad. Bangs the ball forward. Cox floats across the face. But Charlie's out the back. He's getting the Blues fans up. Was Kerno. He's got four. Intercepted. Moved it on. Can Kerno finish the good work? Strikes it well. Hits it pretty clean. Blues fans cheer. And Charlie Kerno. 45 goals for the season, averaging three a game, the most through his career. And he struck that one nicely too. The Blues get the first couple. Been a phenomenal season from Charlie Kernow, given what he's gone through in the last few years. And that would have been a goal if the post were a metre apart. Carlton had five. This is against the run. West Coast have kicked the last two goals of this game. They edge their way back into it, and that is a delight off the boot. That's a work of art from Charlie Kerno. A high degree of difficulty for Kerno, but he whips it back perfectly. They've missed some easy ones, but they can kick the tough ones. And two of five this year. He's loading up for a handful this afternoon as he strikes that one straight through from 50. Charlie Curno's got five and having a big day. Knocks it down towards Selwood. Silvani feigned the handball, then went towards Cottrell. Swings it to Kennedy. Deep ball, where's Charlie Curno? All had it, lost it, time to regather. Puts it through. Blues on the board. Five goals, three last week, Charlie Curno. Well struck, it's bending back. Kerno's got a couple. Good serves. Tom De Koning. Good chance for Walsh at speed. Pick up was good. Long ball to full forward. Kerno out the back with the speed and the bounce and the finish. Charlie's got three. Bruce argues his case. De Koning chips it, hoping for was Silvani in the middle of that pack. Was the leaper? Kerno fought a lot of them. Stayed out the back and gone. Knocked down by Briggs into the congestion. Flick up, Cherub. Doherty hammers it. Kerno takes off, bends it around and nails it. Massive moment. Follow me, boys. Three goals last week, this for number three for this week. The leader in the race for the Coleman. Brilliant. That was a work of art. Averaging 3.1 goals per game. We'll go past that here. Slots his fourth. And Carlton fans can just sit back and enjoy the show now. Schomburg barreled it forward, made a half tackle on Newman. Smith slips at the wrong time. Chera feeds the handball. Modlock further on. Cow! And in the blink of an eye, the Blues are in front. I think they've just got to address the way they move the ball forward, the Crows. They've gone so often to uh, an out number in their forward line. Long launch. O'Brien! Oh, front on contact. Kerno's kicked the goal anyway. He's stolen that from De Koning, who probably deserved it. Charlie Kerno, the Coleman medal leader, hasn't had a lot of opportunity. 
Snuck that one home. Goal to Kerno. So Charlie Kerno, his second of the term. Fantastic. In the context of the season, for a club that's been down for a long time, Charlie puts it through. Blues by eight. Look at the live ladder. Here come the Blues. Chair wants to take a little bit more ground. Here is Mackay in front of hands. Martin did it really well. Got it to Cripps. Cripps to Kurno. Kurno backs up. Loves to kick while on the lean. It's going through. It's there. He kicks a beauty.